Hey, what's going on guys? It's ETA Prime back here again. Today I'm back with the Latte Panda and I wanted to test out the Steam streaming feature. Now what I'm doing is streaming No Man's Sky from my better PC to the Latte Panda. Control, Shift, Escape here. And we'll see I have the Atom X5 8300 CPU. It's a quad core clocked in at 1.4 gigahertz and 2 gigabytes of RAM. So my PC doesn't run No Man's Sky very well. I have to put it on medium settings. Hopefully patches will fix this in the future. It's still a little buggy for me. I haven't really been able to get awesome performance out of it. But we're still going to try it anyway. I have a Xbox 360 controller connected. I'm in big picture mode. And I'm going to start streaming right now. So I'll click on No Man's Sky. Click Stream. It's launching it on my big PC now. And home streaming started. Sweet. So what I did was I moved my user file out. So I'm going to start on a new planet just for this demo. I really hope the security is very low on this planet. When I first started, I went to start mining and just got destroyed right off the bat. So it does look a lot better on my PC that I'm streaming from. Now you're going to have a little bit of, you know, deterioration over streaming, but it's definitely playable. I do have the settings on medium on my PC that I'm streaming from. Hopefully in the near future, they'll put out a few patches for No Man's Sky and get rid of the glitchiness. Because every once in a while when I'm playing No Man's Sky, on my big PC, I just get glitching when I'm trying to move around. It's really annoying. Standard. Man, there's one flying around right there. I don't know, man. I really hate it when it does this. I might not mind too much in this video because I don't want to get destroyed. All right, so let's get started here. Um, there is security on this planet, which really sucks because it really inhibits you from mining everything you really wanted to. But for now, I really need to fix my vis my scanner and my visor. So I need some iron and I need some carbon. Let's go get some. There's some iron right there. Just, I really hate this when these sentinels are flying around. And I'm getting a lot of lag right now, which is very disappointing. Earlier when I tried this, it ran very well streaming. Man, I need 25 carbon and 25 iron. Let's go get some more. He is not, they are not going to leave me alone. Oh my gosh, I need one more. I was sure I had enough there.
yeah, something's just not right with the streaming right now. All right, so let's fix one of these at least. There we go. Let me scan the area. Yeah, that's pretty bad. I'm Something's definitely going on. Let me see. Can I control alt delete out of here? Hmm. I don't know. My RAM, yeah. Lack of RAM is really killing me here. What else do I have running down here? Nothing. Try to reconnect to it. See if that helps. Oh, that little guy's going to try to kill me. I need more iron, so I'm just going to start mining here. Need some carbon to fill up my mining tool again. Please. I'm done. I'm not mining anymore. Get out of here. Jeez, man. Oh, well. Now my pulse engine. Two more sheets. Okay, we can do that really quick here. As long as he gets out of my way, I can get the rest of this iron here. God, man. Get out of here, dude. Really sucks. Should be enough. I need one more? I guess so. Let's get out of here. After restarting the streaming, it actually seems to work a little better. Oh man, I forgot I gotta refuel the freaking launch. 
thrusters here. Oh man, this is looking gloomy. Oh well, well you guys see, I mean it works pretty decently. I'm gonna try with a wired connection on both my PC and the Latte Panda, just to see what happens. We'll probably get a little better performance out of it then. It gets a little glitchy every once in a while, but it, I think it's due to my connection that I have set up. Appreciate you guys watching. If you could, hit that like button and subscribe because I got a lot more coming. If you have any requests to see anything running on the Latte Panda or the Raspberry Pi, let me know in the comments below and I'll try my hardest to get it made as soon as possible. And like always, thanks for watching.